Go right. So there you go. As I said, with the most powerful novels, and I love Tarsha, about to demand the next monarch coronation. My mind feels separate from my body. I don't know anything about politics. I don't know where really here. Here I am, watching the Duma leader decide to fight all of Tarsha. Members of the Duma. The Grand Duma has voted upon the choice of Tarsha's next monarch. I mean, actually, it's not going to open this group of any mentality of the Grand Duma's vote. I still can't believe I helped the Duma make its decision. I should be back in Fikand right now, sitting on a beach with Lorenzo. But hopefully this will be all over soon, and I can turn to my true world. Oh. Attention! Wait! Objection! <laughs> Objection, Your Honor! How's Bajari? I have received information that changes everything. Oh my god, that changes everything! While we were taking the vote... <laughs> Just because politicians are talking does not mean the rest of the world is not working. <laughs> Go ahead. I have received the report from the castle physicians on the death of Queen Bellatrix. <laughs> you received the report? Seraphine? While you may believe we are all brutes, House Pajari has produced more doctors <laughs> than any other family in Darzia. Proximity to the battlefield does give far more opportunities to practice surgery. Lady Rosa, what does the report say? Queen Bellatrix's death was no accident. Even if she hadn't fallen off her horse on the hunt... Well, that's obvious. Her blood contained high levels of the poison known as Vadrant Root. Hmm. <gasps> <gasps> Oh, that was quiet. This, this is terrible. The rebels in the south have gone too far. They need to be starved out by the animals they are. It probably wasn't them. We cannot be sure that the red scarves have anything to do with this. I mean, she looks like maybe a dude. What are you suggesting? It was you. Allah. Funny you would ask. Who benefits from this the most? The rebels, of course. Darzia is in chaos. That was you, Ru. Ru. No, Darzia is just fine. We have a system of dealing with tragedies like this, and up until this point, it appeared to be working. I don't know the first thing about Vedric Root, the rebels, or why anyone here might have purposely poisoned our last queen. I just want us to figure out so I can back to. get back to my normal life? If not the rebels, then who? Vedric Root is not simple to grow. Jesus. It requires patience, fertile soil, just the right temperature, and luck to cultivate a single seed. And we will have the gardeners interrogated at length. I need to interrogate you! You Ruben. are missing the point, Reuben. Perhaps willfully. There is a certain person at this table who wouldn't need any of that to grow the poison. Wait. You mean... You! I don't know anything about this! Descendants of Dimitro have a way with plants. Do they not? Are you accusing me of killing Queen Bellatrix? Wait, but that's Serafina. She's... Not the protagonist? You may lack a spine for murder, but you could have provided Reuben with the supplies. Lady Vajari has a point, Sir As has been discussed multiple times, you are the natural successor to Queen Bellatrix. So she killed her own mother? I have no doubt that it is your name printed on the scroll returned by the Grand Duma. I would never do anything like that. How long have we known each other, Kendall? I'm not a killer. Perhaps not. But there is another who would gain from putting you on the throne. Oh, you mean me. Quite astute. 
I'm glad you are paying attention, Reuben, because I wanted to tell you a story. Mm. Oh, delightful. I hope it has a happy ending. A bastard without land or title seduces the heir to the second most powerful house in the land. He uses that connection to usurp control of his father's house, despite having no claim to the name. The font is annoying. I'm bored already. But that's not enough, because he is a descendant of Malian, Lord of Greed. His very nature demands more. Maybe the syrup is annoying me. So I poison the queen, what does that get me? One poisoned queen? Well, your wife on the throne. You're not king, but crown prince certainly sounds better than bastard. Wait a minute. If we're throwing names around, Reuben and I are the only possible suspects. Oh? If you want to talk about who stood to gain from Bellatrix's death, just look at who took House Randall's seat on the Duma. Oh, please. That's right. You knew that you had the tax revenues to move on to the Duma. But one of us had to die so you could replace them. And how would we obtain Vedra Root? I don't know, but you just testified that your family is full of doctors. Maybe they could procure it. Or maybe you knocked her off her horse, and this story about poison is fabricated entirely by your family. Nonsense. Absolute nonsense. And what about you, dear Kendall? I can't see how I'd be implicated in any of this. You talk a big talk about houses and titles, but you seem so ignorant of your own. Yeah, House Terrace isn't just known for like diplomats, it. is it? It's also known for spies. Of course they are. Spies is a nasty word. Let's go take a look at the history of your house's great accomplishments. I suspect we don't have to go too far back before we find stories of using poison to silence your enemies. Mm hmm? Who's the cougar? Now I will take your word for it. That is probably true. But it does not change the fact that I had nothing to do with Bellatrix's death. We've got a problem, Patriarch. No matter which name is printed on that scroll, Seraphina, Rosa, Kendall, or Ruby, they are a suspect in the murder of the last queen. And thus they cannot take the throne. What? I came back here for nothing? The rules are quite clear. If the death of a previous sovereign is under suspicious circumstances, her successor cannot be named until the culprit is found. Or all the suspects are cleared. So what does that mean? It means that there will be no election. Not today. And not until we know who killed Bellatrix Randall. Or all the suspects are clear. <laughs> but the Duma is leaderless. The rules only provide for a meeting without a sovereign under one circumstance. The election of a new sovereign. Then we must name a regent, a sovereign who will preside over the investigation into the death of Queen Grandil and rule over Darzia until we solve this murder. We have to pick someone? There's only one person at this table who can fill that role. So this is what is do you mean? Arkham? I nominate Odell Perrin for regent. Is, oh my what? God. <laughs> That's right. Odell is the only one on the Elite Duma, and perhaps in the Grand Duma, who we know with absolute certainty did what? not murder Queen Bellatrix. I didn't know that she was in the country. She is the only choice. And they accused me of having no experience. Ho ho ho. This is all dream, right? This can't really be happening. But it is. 
Cool Lorenzo. All of a sudden, he's a king. Well, or not. I don't know. Some kind of regent. Anyway. Hey.